My name is Keith Salmon um, and uh, I'm a visual artist, um, I'm a painter and I work um, in a studio in Irving in North Ayrshire in Scotland. I've, I've, I've always loved painting right from a very early age when I was a child. The other sort of great interest in my life has, has, has always been hill walking. The two interests um, sort of I kept separate. My hill walking was one interest, my art was another. Um, and I didn't combine them. Instead of keeping my hill walking and my painting separate, I should combine the two and use these wonderful sort of trips into the wild as sort of a um, uh, source for the work that I did when I got back to the studio. My art. I say it has changed over the years and, and one of the reasons it's changed um, is that in 1990, um, after sort of almost 30 years of having a really good sight, my, my sight deteriorated very rapidly um, and um, it, was, it was caused by long-term diabetes. To start with, as an artist, as a hill walker, um, I, I really wondered how I might be able to carry on with both interests. Um, with the hill walking, I thought, well, you know, it's pretty dangerous when you can't see where you're putting your feet. Um, and then as, a, as an artist, I went, like, yeah, what's the point of, of trying to create paintings and drawings and sculptures um, if you can't really see them? It's, it just sort of dawned on me one day that um, you don't really have to see anything to be able to scribble. You know, even if you're totally blind, you can scribble. And through scribbling a line, you create um, the appearance of detail. It might be fairly random, might be fairly abstract, but a scribbled line is quite detailed. And it, it got me thinking, and I, I thought, well, perhaps I could create drawings out of, of scribbled marks, which were random but in a way controlled and so i started doing these these drawings which i described to people as organized scribbles and they were pastel lines that were put down starting with some um, very light colors and tones and gradually sort of building them up and pulling vague images out um, and i was quite excited by the drawings even though i couldn't really see what i was doing um, and over the years, I've just gradually, and I'm still doing it, I'm gradually developing this way of working. And so these sort of two interests, which were so separate, sort of before my sight went bad, have now sort of come together um, and have developed in a way that um, is, well, it's creating a different kind of landscape painting. Um, uh, and it's, well, it's very enjoyable, yeah, yeah.